Salam and welcome back to Super Zombie Player. Apparently this guy is the guy I need to talk to, so... It's the Ordonian! You seem familiar, but then your clothes seem kind of different, so I got thrown off for a second. <laughs> because I don't have object permanence. <laughs> or like facial recognition, or whatever that thing is that allows you to recognize that a person is the same person even though they're wearing a different outfit. Listen, things have been a little off about here lately, so you should watch Step, okay guy? There's so many monsters right now, I got kind of scared and closed off the path of the temple. But you guy, you want to get back there, huh? You have a bird's nest upon your noggin. <laughs> Check you out, man. Nice accessories. Cover in really thick fog, so make sure your lantern's full. Definitely gonna need to use your lantern oil in there. Spring all the oil you can. And check this out. I have a special one-time offer of a bottle full of lantern oil for only 100 rupees. How about a guy? What a bargain. Well, I mean, yeah, it's a fucking bottle. I want the bottle. Oil or not, I want the bottle. And I can keep the bottle. Hell yes. You're kind of cute. I like you. <laughs> um, where is the out? Where is the way? The way to the way, 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 way. Wait, no. Wait, no. This way. The way that I came from has the gate, right? So I follow that. <laughs> and then I can move on to the forest temple. Yeah. This way. Yes! Taza! Tink! Just drops. The lock just falls down. And he doesn't relock it. He really should lock it back up again for safety's sake instead of just fucking leaving it open. Like, this dude went to all this trouble to lock the gate. And you're just gonna leave it open like it ain't no thing. Thank you for still being lit so I don't have to waste my lantern oil. Um, well, there's a mini-map, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Shink. Hearts are good. I like hearts. Darkness falls across the land. The midnight hour is close at hand. Creatures crawl in search of blood to terrorize y'all's neighborhood. <sighs> the rumble feature is a little bit delayed, so like when I strike a bunch of things in a row, it just keeps rumbling for a while after I'm done, which is a little weird. Oh, here we are. In the poison bog that is the Farron Woods. Shink. 100 rupees on the nose. Um, ooh, I gotta get around here without... Does the, um... Does the lantern clear the creepy fog? Great! <laughs> Thanks, monkey. With the fucking butt. Oh, she's clearing away the creepy fog for me. Thanks, monkey. You're very humanoid for a monkey. Hey, what's that monkey's problem? You idiot, while you're staring off into dreamland, your lantern got stolen. I mean, clearly this monkey is more intelligent than either of us, so she's just, she's just trying to help. That's all it is. I trust her. I trust the monkey. Follow the monkeys. In Zelda games, you follow the monkeys. This is gonna be a while, isn't it? Yes, I know, I'm following you. You're just taking your sweet time clearing the path when you just have to walk up to it and it's clear. But you know, it's all right. Can I get there while she's... Will it clear enough? Can I reach that? Nope, I cannot. <laughs> Never mind. That is something to do later when the creepy fog is gone. Creepy fog is a mechanic they've already used in Wind Waker, isn't it? In, uh... The Wind Temple. Is it the Wind Temple? Yeah, the one with the Rito. Not to be confused with Ruto, the Zora princess, who is creepily obsessed with you. That was fun. Ow, monster! Oh no! Aw, she's so cute. Look at her, she's adorable. Thanks, little monkey friend. Yeah, but like, monkeys in the Lost Woods. You always follow the monkeys. The monkeys know where to go, and they want to help. And people are scared of them for some reason. But they're just trying to help. They just can't, you know, speak human talk. They don't speak Hylian. Is that the language they're speaking here? Hylian? I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> Does it- what other languages are there? There's like ancient Hylian. But I get- no, I guess it's ancient in Wind Waker, but it's just Hylian. But like, I guess the Zoras have their own language, probably the Rito have their own language that evolved from the Zora language. But... Are there other, like, humanoid species? Or are they all Hylian? No, the Kokiri are their own humanoid species, but are they speaking Hylian or are they speaking 
a Kokiri language. I don't actually know because they all fucking speak English or Japanese or whatever language you're um, playing the game in. Give me my fucking lantern back. The oil's all gone, right? Yeah. Well, there wasn't much oil in it to begin with, so that's fine. Um, wait, no. Items. How do I use it? Can I, like... Uh, no. Do I have to have them both? I do. And then I do this. Okay, you equip both of them and then you use the lantern oil and then you fill the lantern with the oil and then there you go. And so that goes there. And that goes there. Yeah! Bust out the sword, you're ready to go! First temple time! Oh yeah! First real temple. Here we go. Eleven episodes in, we're finally getting to the temple. Okay. Fuck both of you. Right in the face. Dux. You're Dux. Wait, what? Oh, it's this guy. That's right. Um, might as well get some potion. Yes. Potion's good. Uh, s I need to equip a bottle. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, equip this Pashan. Excellent. How much was that? 30 rupees? Great. Where do I pay? There's the box. It's all honor system. I like it. And he's like so shocked that you actually paid for it and you paid the right amount too. I've never seen what happens if you pay too much. Come back sometime! You actually paid for it! Thank you so much for actually paying for your goods that you purchased from me, a bird! <laughs> I am but a bird! Oh my gosh, it's a wolf that is glowing with the gold. Golly gee. Oh, is the introduction of the special technique world alternate dimension place thing. I mean, he looks a bit like you, so you should really know by now to not even... I mean, I guess he doesn't know what he looks like in wolf form. He just sees a big glowing fucking wolf, and then it transforms into a thing that's going to attack him. Well, shut your fucking face and tell me the technique you want to do. Grrr. You must use your courage to seek power. And find it, you must. Fucking Yoda-ass talk. Find it, you must. Find it, you must. If you do find true courage and you wish to save Hyrule from the horrors it now faces, then you would be worthy to receive the secrets I hold. Mm. Oh, already the ending blow. I guess that's the first one you learn. Rad. Ending blow. Yay, 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 yay. Shink. That's a pretty cool, like, swordsman handshake. Am I supposed to hit him a couple times first? There we go. Stab! Right through the heart. You are a skeleton. You don't have a heart. Oh, he has like a body. He's like a living armor, but like with a skeleton face. Stab! <laughs> Aggressively, then the sword gets stuck in the ground and he can't pull it out. Like, eh, eh, um, just give me a sec. Sorry. Sorry about it. <laughs> uh, that would be funny. But it wouldn't be very badass, would it? <laughs> Farewell! No, get the fuck out! <laughs> I gotta take a whiz! <laughs> Can a skeleton ghost monster take a piss? I don't know. Who knows? Who cares? He's gone now. Now we're gonna kill some fucking moblins! Or Bacablins, whatever they are, I still don't know. It's okay, it doesn't matter. Lantern fire! Fire fixes everything. <laughs> the creepy face I was making did not really translate well over a microphone, did it? Um, cool, forest temple time! Yay! The quintessential first Zelda dungeon. The forest temple. Always. And forever. No, don't swing it. Put it away. Fucking... God damn it! don't you know what I mean when I press the wrong button? 
You should know what I actually wanted to do. Boy, Link sure can turn on a dime, huh? Can't say the same for his horse, but that's all right. Fuck yo shit. I will end your life. Funny how an actual sword made of like probably live steel is as effective as at busting this open as a stick was. Yes, thank you, monkey. I figured out that I should climb that. F Midna, are you not understanding it? Are you not? Are you not understanding what's happening here? You're always the one who's like, oh, it's so obvious. You don't get it. Well, fucking, you don't get it? Really? <laughs> she's trying to help. Look at it. She's so cute. She's so cute. Oh, precious. Ooh, pots. Must break all the pots. All the pots. Sup, monkey? Okay, I'll open the door for you. You could have probably opened that yourself, but I guess it was kind of heavy. And I am a very strong farm boy. Oh my gosh, it's a spider! It's a spider! Oh, she's so cute! She's adorable! Oh my god, I hate that they curl up like that. And fucking... Ugh, they're too real! Too fucking real! Ugh, the gritty realistic reboot. Ugh. Lanterns? Lanterns. How many are there? Four, naturally. Gimme, fuck it. Yay! I activated a thing! Hooray! Stairs. I love it. Okay, monkey. Wait, I have to get this treasure chest because I need all the stuff. Give me all the stuff. A map? G hooray! The dungeon map. Okay, monkey, I got it, I got it, I'm coming, Jesus Christ. Jesus Cristo! It's so bright in here. Oh my god, the wind. Oh my god, the things with the rotating platforms, the fucking bridge, this shit. Please do not knock me to my death. Oh god. <laughs> oh no, it's a monster. Oh, I'm gonna get the Gale Boomerang now. It's even fucking glowing with dark shadow energy. Oh no, the monkey! Is that a monkey too? But like has a beak? Is it wearing a ma Oh, it's a baboon thing. Okay. <laughs> but it's wearing like a helmet mask thing. Good grip you got there, monkey friend. Okay, okay. Jesus Christ, fucking monkey. Oh, what's going on? Has there been a monkey fight? Well. Uh-huh. Yeah, thanks. There's literally a character guiding you through the temple, telling you where to go. It's great! No, it's good. We're fucking doing so much. Ook. Oh, are you gonna help me? Like a, a doop and a weep. There we go. Instead of Midna, we have Monkey. For when you're a human. When you're a human. Uh, lantern? Cool. Where am I going now? It's a thing that is creepy. Oh, they're bombs. Oh, boy. <laughs> Convenient that that bug is also an explosive. Oh, my God. Ah. Oh, they grow back. Okay. Well, next time on Super Zombie Player, we're going to meet whatever's in that vase. Peace, love, and geekdom. Goodbye!